Thousands of Singaporeans have been paying tribute this week to former Prime Minister Lee Kuan Yew, the man credited with transforming the country into one of the world's wealthiest nations. Lebanese artist Laudi Abilama is one of many who've commemorated his death with a show at the Sana Gallery. Since a few years ago, the Prime Minister Lee Kuan Yew theme was a no-go area for art and artists. Now we can see that uh, a few artists have started to work on this theme. Um, I hope uh, they will continue as Prime Minister Lee Kuan Yew is a very inspiring icon. Abilama says she was inspired by her time spent in the country at an artist's residence. He was pivotal in making his country what it is today. It, Singapore has huge similarities to Lebanon in particular because of its multicultural society, yet he's managed to make it rather harmonious, whereas we've managed to implode and slightly self-destruct, if you like, over time, unfortunately. Abi Lama says although Lee Kuan Yew was feared for his authoritarianism, she admired his approach to Confucian values of discipline, order and respect for education. Unfortunately, what's happening now, we belong to uh, a, a world that is effectively 22 failed states, failed dictators, failed democratics, everything has kind of meshed into nothing. And so searching for someone like Lee Kuan Yew was inevitable for me as a Lebanese young woman, as a young woman, and also to, for, for the whole world, you know, to understand the way the world works and to interpret different poli political ideas and different systems, if you like. Laudi Abilama's portrait show continues at Singapore's Sana Gallery until April the 26th.